sent me alongside their message, I was shocked. 很感动。当全世界都在给俄罗斯难看时，只有你们中国的兄弟姐妹没抛弃我们。俄罗斯当别的地方，真是个奇妙的地方。诸事是土豆。This is not Olga. Her name is April, and she's been living in China for eight years. She has my voice, my face, and she speaks fluent Mandarin. And here's Natasha. She's a 31-year-old Russian woman who decided to come to China to sell and advertise Russian food. I kept checking the links, terrified to realize that there's not one, but an army of my clones, each getting thousands of likes and comments. But the worst part of the story still awaited me. This is so creepy. I feel so uneasy watching this. Thanks to the advances in GPT and multi-model models, we now have a recent explosion of AI deepfakes, which can generate narrative, video, and audio. I am not Morgan Freeman, and what you see is not real.